Welcome to the luxurious five-star Dusatani Cebu. The resort offers a unique mix of Thai and Filipino hospitality. By the end of this video, you'll know if this resort is for you. Located on Mactan Island, Cebu, it's around a 20 minute drive away from the airport. The resort itself opened in 2019 and it already has gained a reputation of being one of the best luxury resorts in Cebu. And to no surprise, the infinity pool is definitely a crowd pleaser. So this is the star of the resort, the infinity swimming pool. Just a perfect way to start your vacation, lazing by the pool with some food or a nice cocktail. They also have another smaller unassuming pool called the forest pool, located between the two buildings. This one is a little bit more quieter. It's well worth a look if you're staying and it has a beautiful little waterfall. So I have to talk about this eyesore you can see behind me here. Now that ship was out over there and due to the typhoon, it was pushed onto the rocks here. Now they have tried to salvage it. They don't have the Thunderbirds here, but apparently it's stuck here for good on the rocks there. So they've been putting around ideas that maybe to turn it into a floating restaurant or something. Speaking to a guard later, he was telling me that they plan to scrap it and get rid of it completely. So hopefully it's a temporary site. But anyway, luckily it's not right in front of the resort, but it's on the side, so yeah, it's a bit ugly. Before the ship was washed ashore, you used to get these amazing sunsets from the pool. Welcome to Sunset Sports Bar. So next to the pool is this place. So to one side of this restaurant is an open area where you can see the pool and the ocean. It's a nice casual place to eat at. The food here in general is pretty good with a mix of local and international cuisine. To see what they did offer, here's a copy of the menu and the prices. On the weekends they were serving up a buffet, not particularly huge by any means. Overall it was okay, so the buffet itself had a number of different hot dishes, salads, fruits and desserts. Saturday night they had a band playing and on Sunday they had a DJ. The highlight here is definitely the make your own pizza. Hello, this is Nikki from Sunset Sports Bar and welcome. By the way, we have here our pizza menu. You can also create your own pizza as well. And for the creator on pizza, you can choose for the meat, you can choose whatever you want. We have the salami. If you want only the salami, if you really love uh, a fan of ham, you can choose only choose the ham only. And then for the vegetables, so the, we have the bell pepper, uh, the pineapple, chili, whatever you want. And then also the cheese, by the way, for the cheese. Oh, I love cheese, by the way. Buon appetit. Just take a look at that pizza, yum. The highlight here is the pizza, it's particularly ones you can make yourself. These pizzas are really good. And I mean it's the best pizza I've ever tasted in Cebu. Their set pizzas, while nice, are just not in the same league as choosing your own toppings. So being a Thai resort, you must check out their Thai restaurant. Sabudika, welcome to Benjerong. It's a stylish place where you can enjoy authentic Thai cuisine. The food here was just delicious. Look at this. So good. So this dish is the patsy eel. You can see that. It smells delicious. And for me, it's the best Thai food I've tasted in Cebu, period. So Adika, welcome to Benjerung. This is Christmas Eve special dinner. All right, come drink, sir. Yeah. It's made of blue turnip flour. It's antioxidant drinks, and we're adding a flavor of lime juice and sugar. It changes color because of its reaction. So tonight, for Christmas Eve, they've got their special set menu. Hopefully, it tastes good. Live music, and that food was just to die for. I can't stop raving about it. The Christmas dinner was fully booked, a very busy night. While under the pressure with all the guests, the staff was still friendly, and overall, it made for a great Christmas dinner. Definitely not cheap, but an impressive dinner for sure, with great flavors and presentation. Two thumbs up. What's this one called? This one is called Ud Kim Crop. Water chestnut, coconut cream, jackfruit, and shaved I was actually back at the restaurant the next day to try another dish. This was the curry, delicious and spicy. For your reference, this is the menu. They have the deli here if you want some coffees, ice creams. Go have a look and see what else we got. So the best sellers are the cookies and cream and what was it? Rocky Road. Lots of different flavors, pastries and donuts. And you've got some little cakes here and even sandwiches. Uh, we also have coffees, milk peas, 
Yes, and also wine, sir. Okay, cool. How do you say this? Classic in Saimada. Ubi in Saimada. Bestseller. Bestseller. Okay. For pasta lubung, sir. You can dine in or take away. Next door is the view. Welcome to the view lunch. What's the best seller here? Our best seller for the cocktail, sir, which is margarita. The frozen margarita. This is, this the is a frozen margarita from Dositani Maktan. Your specialty. Special. The best signature, seller. Signature drinks. Signature yeah. drinks. Enjoy the frozen margarita. Thank you. Cheers. Recommended. Hi, good morning. Welcome to Trade Trade Winds is their other restaurant. This one's a buffet restaurant. It's open for breakfast, and the breakfast is actually quite good. Nice size and a great selection of dishes. Depending on the number of guests they have, they may have a buffet lunch or dinner here. So Adika, welcome to the Sitani Maktan Nam Spa. Our signature massage is a Thai massage, which is a um, traditional massage. And we have also offer um, uh, treatments here like facials, um, body treatments, and massages. This is our couple room, so if you have a massage, you have already free jacuzzi and you can enjoy the steam bath also. Bath and um, shower room are together. And if you are enjoying the steam bath, you can just sit down here. Let's look at the resort's beachfront. This is another man-made beach here. As you can see, it's quite gravelly. So it's not that soft white sand that you expect when you come to paradise. It's quite rocky on this end of the beach. There's pipes sticking out of the beach here. I don't want to beat around the bush, but the beach is pretty crap. Better to swim in the pool. Cebu has some beautiful beaches that it's famous for. This ain't it. They did tell me they have plans of redeveloping this beach area. So in the future, it should look a lot better. Hello, I'm April. Welcome to Dusi Tani Maktan's Kids Fun Zone. Um, yes, 300 per hour and 600 for unlimited. We have the active play, play zone, the play maze. Yes, sir. And as well as we also have the um, what do you call this one? Interactive game. So what is this? Um, kids will throw balls on the Santas and it will count points. So got... Just like you're going to throw balls on the Santa and it will count points. So what if I throw Santa? Yes, and it will count the points up on the top of the... Can I cheat? Can I cheat? No, <laughs> of course not. <laughs> See you soon. Thank you for coming. So with it being Christmas when I stayed, there was a guest appearance from Santa, and there was also a choir singing some Christmas carols. Fun for all the family. Behind me is the gym. As you see, there's quite a few people inside here. They're trying to burn off those Christmas calories here. Quite a busy place for sure. Out here was the yoga area. It had been damaged from the typhoon, and it was still not 100% fixed. For cash, they also have a number of ATMs. So let's look at the rooms, including the club and suite rooms. First up is the deluxe. So this is the twin bed setup. It also comes in a king. It's a nice, comfortable room and a decent size. Nice amenities and the beds are really comfy. It has a clean and modern bathroom. And it's worth noting on their website, they do mention that with a king bed setup, the bathroom comes with a bathtub as well. While the twin room only has a shower. Here's a 101 marketing terms. Garden view equals car park view. Definitely not the most spectacular view. If you do want a view, make sure to book the sea view. Obviously come in with a price. Inside the room is identical. What you do get extra is the balcony with the ocean view. Just beautiful. You get a view of both the pool and the ocean. With the king bed set up, the bathroom had a bathtub. Other than that, everything else is the same in the bathroom here. Now if you book one of their club rooms, you get access to the club lounge. Hi guys, my name is Kevin and this, I am a Ducit Club officer. So welcome to Ducit Club Lounge. This club lounge is for the club paying guests for our club rooms. And we are offer for uh, breakfast here. Complimentary. Six, complimentary breakfast, 6.30 to 10.30. And we are also having our high tea. It's about 2.30 to 4.30. And the most awaited part, we have our evening cocktails. We have only beers, only wines. And we have gold cuts, cheese. Starts at 5.30 to 7.30. Come on, come on guys, and join for our Ducit Club Club Lounge. So this is actually inside the lounge. 
So unfortunately I missed out on the high tea, I checked in too late, but I will show you the cocktails here. I'll let Kevin explain what happens during high tea. Hi guys, for our high teas, we have a different kind of canopies. We have also for drinks, hot and cold beverages like coffee, teas, and we have also chill juices. We have pineapple, mango, and four season. So this is the evening cocktail time. And as you can see, there's a good selection of snacks for you to enjoy with your drinks. It's a great time just to chill out. So cocktail hour, I've got my glass of red and a few snacks, you see that? And then you can look out the window. You've had a good day, you could watch the sunset, but just terrible weather at the moment in Cebu. Hello, Sawadika, good morning. We are here at the Dusset Club Lounge and right now breakfast is happening. As you can see, we have a buffet here. Buffet time, I mean, buffet usually happens during the peak season or the holiday season. And since it's um, normal days or regular days, we usually have a la carte. So this is our menu here. So yeah, that's it. Enjoy your breakfast. The buffet choice isn't as extensive as the one in the main restaurant downstairs, but it's still pretty good. It's also not so busy and noisy. If you wish, you can choose to eat at the main buffet instead of this one. Just to mention also with the buffet, you get a choice of having how you want your egg. Anyhow, you have more sanity here with it being a lot quieter. This is the deluxe club room. It is larger in size than the deluxe room I just showed previously. Other than that, it's fairly much identical with the exception of the front foyer area, which I'll show in a moment. So with this room type, you also get the balcony with the beautiful views of the ocean. I do like the room. It comes with the same amenities but with an added sink and larger fridge that you can see here in the front of the room. Obviously, with the benefits of the club room, you do pay extra, which I'll show that later on in the video. The bathroom actually had a separate cubicle for the shower and toilet. There was no bathtub in this bathroom. Looking at the suite rooms, this is the one bedroom suite. They had an extra bed set up for a third person. They also have a two bedroom suite option as well, which I'll show in a moment. It was a nice touch to get the welcome suites. This is the living area offering, obviously a more spacious area to stay with comfortable chairs and a table. There was also a sink to one side. Then walking into the main bedroom, it came with a king size bed. Again, a nice room. The TV was huge here. A wardrobe to one side. Outside was a balcony with beautiful views of the pool and ocean. The bathroom was larger too, complete with a bathtub and separate shower. Really nice bathroom. Now this is the two bedroom suite room. The living area is just huge with places to relax in front of the TV and there was a sink and table and chairs. And what was really nice was getting these suites upon arrival. Walking into the main bedroom, pretty much the same as the other suite room. So the same applies to what I said about the other room. It's nice and modern, comfy bed, large TV. What more could you want? It has a nice modern and spacious bathroom with bathtub and separate shower. The second bedroom had two beds for the kids or for those who are in the bad books with their partner. The room also had its own bathroom with bathtub and separate shower. As you can see, it's quite spacious and a nice setup. Overall, great room if you need the extra space. On the Dusatani's website, you can find out more information on the resort. So these are the room rates for the different rooms I've shown. The prices are fairly comparable with other resorts on the island on the pricier side of things. You can also book via your favorite third-party site. So the two things I really like about this resort is this behind me, the infinity pool, and also their Thai restaurant. So it is a good resort here in Mactan Island. It's not the best, and I'll go into that in another video, but overall, it's highly recommended. Now, if you wanna see another awesome luxury resort in Mac Tan Island, I recently reviewed this one on screen. I really enjoyed staying there, and I think you will too. So take a look and see what you think. I'll see you in that video.